This game does an amazing job of setting the mood. Oh, you'll be functional now, right? Hello, small person. You're not much bigger than I am. Welcome to the lookout point. Below us is the old quarry. The head engineer lives a little more to the east. This, the entrance to the old mines is further to the east, I see. I did know that already. That's alright. I mean, I don't think there's any way that you could talk to that robot without knowing that, because otherwise it would not be powered. Excuse me, miss. I found this book. Do you know anything about it? Let me see. What language is this? I'm sorry, I don't even recognize this writing system. Ah, uh, well, it was worth a shot. Hello, uh, this insignia. Hold on to the journal for now. It will be important. Okay. The insignia. What about it? I can't see it. Is it the clover? Wait, it has clovers on it. This area is covered in clovers. This area has a ton of clovers in it. Am I supposed to- whoops. Am I supposed to be, take that to mean that the journal has to do something here? I'm watching over the plants. Okay. So, I have a journal. Nobody can read it. Part of it is written in a language that nobody understands, but there is an insignia that's interesting to Silver for some reason, which she won't give us. But it looks like the clovers in her area, which is interesting. Well, I think that it's about time that we go back to that robot that wasn't powered on. To take the boat across the city. Uh, not the city, the sea. How about we go back there? I'm functional. Mm -hmm. A robot, it's beyond repair. It's an interesting world that they've set up here. So now, where was that robot I saw on a dock before? Oh, right there. I am functional. Was it you who fixed the generator? Well, Anthony helped me. But yeah. Hello, nice to meet you. I am Robot number 310. Would you like me to take you somewhere? Are you okay? I cannot move. 
Well, you're still really, rest really rusty. That is true. Hold on, Anthony and I will find a way to help you. Another thing we can do is we can actually go further north now. We have a gas mask. So I'll just do that, but I think that I'm just about going to call it quits here. This is a much longer part than the original. We have a much longer video than the original I recorded. Should be fine with this gas mask on. Should. What's this? This pond sure looks different. The water looks like jelly. It's formed a bubble over the surface of the pond. Oh, like the blue phosphor? Shrimp? The sky is dark. That it is. Do you know when the sun will be up? We're working on it. Interesting. A different pond. I love this. This is great. It's kind of sad, though. A note. I don't want to go near that thing. Initially, the amount of noxious fumes emitted by the natural gas vents caught our team off guard. Thank goodness the medical team reacted as quickly as it did. Despite its failure, that first expedition did bring up some interesting observations about the Barrens. We found that there's not one, but two such fence zones. With fumes being pumped out at some such high concentrations, it seems like a miracle the gas hasn't spread anywhere else. Ibero has just concluded that the phosphorus shrimp and the creator pools were actively consuming the gas. The shrimp in the ocean also prevent the gas from wafting off into the glen. If that's the case, we owe a lot to these little guys. This vent is on the ground. All the others are taller than me. I don't think we can do anything with that right now. Well, we do have an empty bottle. I can't combine those. Oh, no, that's not what I meant to do. Fill the bottle with this gas? That ought to do it. Bottle of smoke. I don't know what... I'm going to do with that right now. But we need to repair that robot in order to get into the next area. Okay, we no longer need the mask. You're now on the north side, I suppose building. In fact, evacuation at such a short notice? I can't believe this. First the sun dies, now I'm out of a job. Some sort of mechanical drawing. You're not gonna show us what this is? A robot is beyond repair. Can we climb the ladder? Here to go anywhere. I'm scared of ladders. You need any help? Good, thanks. The ladder doesn't seem to get us anywhere anyway. What's this? It's from medical pack? Infirmary. Infirmary. Uh, we can't do anything with it? It's glowing like I'm supposed to be able to do something with it. Hello, organic person who is alive. The infirmary is up ahead. Oh, it's a sign. Okay, it's a sign for the building. It's a box of medical tools. Most of them are rusted rusted beyond use, but this plastic syringe seems to be okay. Hello, person. Are you seeking admission into the infirmary? No? Oh, carry on then. Hello, person of organic makeup. Welcome to the infirmary. Scanning for injuries. 
Scan complete. Injuries detected? None. Treatment required? None. You're good to go. Thanks? I guess at some point, if we ever hurt ourselves, then we can come back there. And we'll be good. Hello, organized person who is alive. The infirmary is up ahead. Alright. I'll be honest, I, I'm really liking this so far, and if I keep playing it, I'm going to just uh, continually keep playing it. I'm not going to be able to stop. So I'm going to uh, close this now, but uh, thank you all for watching, and I hope to see you in the next video.